Hello everybody, welcome back to term from Terra Thermocraft. I can't talk. I originally started the video, I didn't get very far, I pretty much just said I was going to check in with you guys, go ahead and start working on some stuff, and I, I, I may, may, I may be in trouble. I started, you know, trying to gather some clay when night fell, just, just over this way, just turn and there's some clay right there. And I got spotted by zombies, and I made the mistake of not running away immediately. I am now trying to fight them off with my pick, waiting for daytime. So I'm going to try to jump in the water and just run around for a little bit. Hopefully I won't die. But I can at least get a drink. Kind of. How far back are they? Yeah. Oh well. They're kind of far off now. See what times it it is going to be a while, folks. Um, yeah. I am about to be sworn. Uh oh. Well, I might just pause here and hopefully when I come back to you I will not be dead. See you guys soon. Alright everyone, I am back. I survived the night by hiding out on that little island over there, running away from the zombies when they came close to me, or swimming away. And I gathered up some clay, and when I came back, my copper was done. And luckily, it had not solidified yet, so I was good to go. I had 1,200 units of copper. I had my mace mold, which is good against skeletons mainly. Um, I have my pro pick mold, my scythe mold, and my saw mold. So we're going to get the saw going. We're also going to get all of these, I think. The mace will be incredibly helpful. I am going to I am going to make a sword in the next batch. Cuz I desperately desperately need one. All right, and it's raining. Oh boy! Well, let's get this going. So you cut the logs, you cut logs like that, and it makes different the different planks, and then this expands that. Woo! About time. Let's make a proper door. Excellent. I like the pressure plate. That way if I run in, I can go easily like that. Um, that I'll just use a couple of these just to walk out the rain a little bit. I am going to make one of these things. I can go ahead and you can put these back. I'm going to show you one last thing before I take a little break. Making it like that will make a barrel. Taking away those two will make a bucket. Now you cannot transport water in the typical vanilla way. You have to have uh, red steel or blue steel. One, one of them you can use with, with lava. And then I think the last tier you can use with water. I don't know why, but you, you have to like make aqua box. Like makeshift aqua box. But this, again, 
just like with the clay thing, you can set down, you can store liquid or solid, and this is the one that gives you 12. Then you can seal it, break it, goes on your back. Even if it's empty, you're still over in comfort. So, I will be back momentarily when I start doing things that actually seem exciting. Alright guys, I'm just going to show you my progress so far. I'm working on some glass. I have slowly started taking apart this. And this is what I have so far. Right now, I just kind of want something to protect myself. A little bit of storage space. I have yet to work on a roof. I'm still working on the windows. But we are getting there. I just wanted to show you what we've been up to. Crops are, are doing okay. They're not quite there. Maybe, maybe we got some green peppers at this point. But again, to maximize the amount of food we get, we just want to let those grow. All the way up to maybe yellow or red, I think would be a, a good idea. We're going to see if maybe we can chop this down or because I've placed it. If, yeah, just, just going to do one log at a time. Nope, not yet. I should probably keep on top of this glass because we really need that to finish up the windows. And let's see, how many do I need? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We probably have enough. Oop, darn it, funky. I don't misplace one. Boom! And there we go. Now we just need to work on the roof. And let us see what else. I, I got some tools ready. Hopefully that will help us. Fine. We should be good from just about everything except for spiders at this point. Like, so let's get all of these tools out of the mold. That is copper ingots. You can't store those in chests. What you can do though is store them on the floor. You can make us like a stack of them. It's actually kind of cool. Just pop that right there. Start our tools. Got that. There's our sword, an extra pickaxe, a nice copper knife, because why not? A chisel, which will be nice. Don't think so. I can probably go ahead and make a couple of racks, which you can simply make by going like this. And let's see where we want to put those legs. Well, I guess probably right here. Why is there not just too well? Not that one. How about this? what I'm doing. Still. <laughs> Alright. Well, let's try that. Probably use those ones on another surface. Okay, I like that a lot better. I think it looks better. Well, let's go ahead. So the chisel for now and our extra pick. I guess you don't need to 
shift for mine. We can probably, yeah, we can store that copper knife. We will use all the stone tools off first. This will probably finish off. I mean, it's done! Nothing. Nothing, I tell you. I'll just dig up some extra clay to use off this. There. Very natural looking. Well, it's filling in. Yes, very natural looking. Another very natural looking glowing pumpkin. Very natural. Much natural. Put one back here. Oh, hungry. Gurgles has the hungers. just throw these up there. They're, they kind of blend in, so that's cool. Oh, extra prospector's pit, too. Let's throw that up there, too. I think anything extra. Alright, now we are down to our copper tools. We do have the stone home. But I think that's fine. That's why we have the stone home. Let's see the progress on our crops still not. Those are ready to harvest. Well, I don't know, I'm pretty good on food for right now. I'd rather wait until they're a little bit big, bigger. Let's check our jute. Oh, we are done. Jute fiber. More jute fiber. Excellent. Let's see about. We'll refill those. Um, pretty sure that's not supposed to happen. Perfectly square. That one has one on there. That's fine. We're getting close enough. Let's make this rope. Oop. I can actually make six. Oh, nope. Seven. What else can I do with this? Jute fiber. What can I use this for? Just the rope. That's fine. It would be nice if I could make a bed with that, but I think I need to either murder or get to the iron point and you make a pair of shears to shear some sheep. Sheep? Is it iron or steel? I don't know. Anyway, that should be it for this episode. 
We have worked on the house. Hopefully we'll at least have some kind of roof next time. I might go ahead and maybe make like a lattice type roof. For now, maybe, or maybe make it smaller. Maybe have it like cone in and then make, maybe make a skylight out of lattice, which would be kind of cool. Um, until next time, this is Gurkles, signing off.